ahead, everybody. Glad you're with us. We got a bit of a wet one coming at you. It's the New York Yankees and the Boston Red Sox. First pitch coming your way next. Just about set to go. And starting this one, Chris Sale. Well, Sale's a strikeout pitcher. And the thing about it is he'll throw strikes early, but then start teasing the zones. And that's what the great ones do. You got to make sure you elevate him, get him out over the plate. That's the only way you're going to have a chance. Okay, all set to go. And stepping in for the Yankees, Anthony Volpe. The pitch. Swing and a miss. Oh, and we're one. underway from Fenway. Sale delivers. Out to short. There's Hernandez handling the chance. He's out. One up, one down. Batting second. The center fielder, number 99. Aaron. It's Aaron Judge Good. now. Go back to New York. And first offering is fouled off. Singy, the Red Sox won the World Series in 2018 in five games. And Chris Sale, normally a starter, ended up coming out of the bullpen. He recorded the final three outs. He struck out the side to finish things off. You and I called that game together. Yes, we did. It was a whole lot of fun. Hey, man, four Anthony pitches, two outs. That is an excellent pace. And here is Anthony Rizzo. This one lifted in the air, left field. That one gets down for a hit. Now he turns and heads for second. And that's a double. Well, that started and ended pretty quickly. No messing around right there. I don't know how he's able to shoot that pitch the other way and still put something on it. That pitch was inside, and he let it get really deep. So pretty incredible hands to fight it off and still get good wood on it. A chance now to take the lead, and at this point in the game, that could be a deciding run. Here comes Glaber Torres. Slice to right. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And that is the third out of the inning. Yanks nothing. Red Sox coming to back. It's Major League. Back here at Fenway. Showing the slab in today's game. Garrett Cole power pitcher he's going to speed you up with the Four fastball velocity ball. and out of his Don't hand will it. explode the breaking ball very difficult for hitters to keep that front side closed and hit the ball the other way because they know if they're not ready to pull the trigger the fastball will beat them nope. next offering is down low Garrett Cole Chris a guy who was the first overall pick out of UCLA in 2011 and he's turned into one of the best starters in baseball yeah it's pretty cool how things came full circle for him drafted by the yankees out of high school didn't sign as you said went to ucla and now pitching the number one guy in the rotation for new york and a ball in two strikes struck him out swinging Chase the fastball up the ladder for strike three. Well, that's always the key to effective pitching is getting ahead in the count. And as a pitcher, it really allows you to start expanding the zone. Guys become defensive, and all of a sudden, for the hitter, that plate starts to get really wide. And what happens is, because of the pressure, you end up committing to a pitch as a batter before you recognize what it is, and that's what leads to the strikeout. Rafael Devers, batting with one down, takes a strike. Devers, the baby-faced assassin. No, Next offering down. is downstairs. And he married another UCLA player's sister, Brandon Crawford. He's married to Brandon's sister, Amy. That one the other way. Pulls it down, and there's two gone. That is third. The designated hitter, 
Justin Turner. Turner climbs in on that right side. Big time power. Aye. Out there on the mound, he's setting the tone early with the fastball. 98 miles per hour up on the scoreboard. Check swing. He went. Oh, and two now. Turner tries to hold up, appeal to first. He did not go around. The one two. Gets a piece and stays alive. Got him looking. That's a strikeout. Red Sox go down quietly. Scoreless after one. Back in Boston, all set for the start of the inning. The Up to the plate steps D.J. LeMayhew. The wind of the pitch. Hard hit, right side. Arroyo whips it to first. Leadoff man retired here in the second. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Let's the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. Now it's Franchi Cordero. Infielder shifted to the right. Shortstop just to the left of second. Swings through that oh, one. Oh, and one. Well, a come and get me fastball right there. He didn't look ready for the velocity. I think it'd be a mistake to throw him anything off speed right here. They say it went. Swings and misses, struck him out. Some high cheese for strike three. Well, take a look at the three-pitch sequence here. Pretty simple in terms of putting them away at the plate. Once you're ahead 0-2 as a pitcher, you can really expand the zone and see how aggressive that hitter is going to be trying to protect and battle. And right there, clearly he was in swing mode, but all you can do is hope to foul that off. And yeah, the batter now, Oswaldo Cabrera. Hard hit left side. Whips it to Casas. That's the third out. Down in order, go the Yankees. Back here in Boston. Now here is Masataka Yoshida. The line to kick the pitch. And that's in there at the knees. Man, that pitch was dotted. So much talent on display when this guy's out there on the hill. Left-hand batter waits. Struck him out looking. Now batting Tristan Casas. Obviously a guy who makes good contact, hits for average. But one of the things in today's game, the value in the fact that he hits both righties and lefties. Going on. And it's even up. Ed Drummond, our umpire behind the plate in this one. Yeah, Boogie's a really fair umpire, both the pitchers and the hitters. So standard strike zone, he's consistent with it. And the great thing is you don't see players question the calls too much. So that's a good thing in this day and age. Next offering is down low. And it's two and two. Good eye in that spot. He's really tightening up his hitting zone with two strikes here. I love it. Christian Arroyo on deck for Boston. And down on strikes he goes. Two gone now. Well, he's really dialed in, and this offense is going to have to do something to try to break that rhythm. Maybe it's square around the bond, step out of the box, agitate him a little bit, do something that just changes what's happening right now because at this pace it's going to be a long game so you got to figure it out quickly here's christian arroyo gotta be careful with this guy he's got power he can untie it with one swing and a good fastball to start him off that's strike one and he pumps in a strike 
quickly in an 0-2 no hole. You're right. going to have to give something up here in terms of power if you want to put the ball in play with any authority. That's Good eye right there. Well, that's kind of what you expect in an 0-2 count. Right. Excellent job of the hitter to have the plate discipline to lay off of that pitch. Missing inside. Two balls, two strikes. Second inning here, no score. Still two and two after the foul ball. The wind of the pitch. Swing and a miss, and that is that. Impeccable command in that one. Three batters, three strikeouts. That's electric stuff out there on the mound. We're back to start the third, and there's a new arm on the mound. Josh Winkowski. Uh, this guy can bring it velocity-wise. Here's Jose Trevino, known for his rocket arm behind the plate. And a pitch. And that one is lifted in the air. Makes the catch one down. Well, such a confidence boost for a reliever to come into the ball game and get the first hitter he faces. Just makes everything slow down a little bit, and then from there can really settle in. Aaron Hicks can't hold up, and that's a strike. Movement in the bullpen. Richard Blyer appears to be getting loose. The pitch. Swing and a foul straight back. Top of the third, no score. Back foot slider ties him up, struck him out. Stood absolutely no chance on that slider right there, and I don't mean to laugh, but that's a tough one. I mean, pretty much a perfect strikeout pitch. I mean, it looks like a fastball middle in, kind of has cutter action, and it just bunches you up to where you can't get your hands through and the barrel to it. And not much you can do unless you recognize the spin early and you spit on it. And time called at the plate. Maybe trying to slow things down here in a crucial spot. And now it's going to be Anthony Volpe. And there's a foul ball. The 0-1. On the ground, right side. And that'll do it. So the Yanks go in order. Still no score. Back here in Boston as we go to the last of the third. Rymel Tapia up to hit. Tapia. Cole back to work. Out towards left center. Could be extra bases. Into second with a double, and they've got something brewing now. Seeing some good swings from them right now with consecutive extra base hits. Put a really nice balanced swing on it, and when you can rope one into the gap like that, you're thinking extra bases from the first couple of steps out of the box, and he'll feel real good about that one. Runner in scoring position now, and a good opportunity to push across the first run of the ball game. Runner in scoring position, no outs. Here's Reese McGuire. There's the strike. Swing and a miss. Cold night tonight, Boog, and that's a pretty firm fastball right there. I tell you what, memories of getting jammed, they creeping in. Got him! Not what you're looking for after the leadoff double. A strikeout, and there's one away. Committed to that breaking ball just a little too Batting much up. and couldn't pull the bat Not back in time. You know, once you get it going, it can be so That's tough to stop the momentum with that barrel. Good pitch, had him fooled. 
on the ground. Volpe throws oh. to first in time. Got the out. The right fielder, number 99. Alex. Here's Alex Verdugo. Went down on strikes his first time through. Foul ball there. Tapia on third with two out. Pretty good pitch there to take a rip at. He wants to get his arms extended. He likes the ball away from him a little bit. Just not able to square it up. The one two stays alive. Left hand hitter waits. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Chase the fastball up the ladder for strike three. Back here at Fenway as we go to the top of the fourth. And now big number 99, Aaron Judge. Listen, there's absolutely no reason to pitch to this guy right here. You nibble, you see if he'll expand his zone, but don't give him anything to hit. If you walk him, not a big deal. You have a double play opportunity set up. Bounce to the left side. Bullet one now. Out to short. Hernandez over to first in time. Leadoff hitter retired in the fourth. Anthony Rizzo steps to the plate. The first Doubled his first time up. In the air, out towards left center. Tapia pulls that one down. Rounder tags at second. The tag, and that's out number three, inning over. Exciting play and a great throw to third for the double play, but man, there's just no reason to try to move up to third right there. Not great base running to end the inning. Back inside Fenway Park, John Chabi and Chris Singleton with you. And leading off the bottom of the fourth, Rafael Devers. Now the right-hander ready to go. Still no score. And that's in for a strike. So a big opportunity here with the score tied and that runner on second to start the bottom of the inning. Yeah, and you know they're eager to cash in. You just don't want to come out of your shoes and make a mistake. Got to play this smart. The 0-2. Up the middle. Throw on to Rizzo. One out in the bottom of the fourth. Here's Justin Turner. Caught looking his first time up. Swing and a miss. And that is strike one. I think ultimately you want to tie him up, get the ball in on the plate so that he can't get the barrel to it and hit it to the outfield. Verdugo stands a third with one gone to the inning. The next offering misses. And it's two and one. Next offering is fouled back. Righty to the plate. Line drive, caught! The left fielder, number seven, Masataka Yoshida. And next for the Red Sox, Masataka Yoshida. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Popped in the air. Left field. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And that is that. And the Red Sox leave one. And we're still knotted at zero. Ready now for the fifth inning. Labor Torres up to hit. Labor. 
The right hander back to work. Strike one. Now try to bunt for a hit right there, and you can tell he's trying to get something, anything going offensively. Swing and that one hammered down the line. If it's fair, it's gone, and that is out of here. Glaber Torres goes yard, and they jump out front. It's 2 nothing. That was blasted. Absolutely no doubt off the bat. was a hanger and pitchers typically don't get away with making a mistake like that and right there he made him pay and that one fouled off Always exciting to see a leadoff home run in an inning. Kind of gets the offense fired up, and you start to expect a big inning. The pitch. Up the middle. Hernandez gets it to first. And that's the first out. Nice recovery after giving up the homer. Good slider inside right the there. Batter better. fighting to get there. Just rolled over it. Got the ground ball. Franchi Cordero stepping in now for the Yankees. Struck out on just three pitches last time. On the ground, right side, Arroyo. And they got him. Now batting, the right fielder. Two outs, base is empty. Oswaldo Cabrera. Cabrera now at the plate. Grounded out to short in his first trip. That's in there. That's strike one. Swing and a line drive. Base hit out of the center field. And that keeps the inning going. Couldn't have timed it up any the better than that. That pretty much split the zone down Jose. the middle. And those are the ones where you got to make them pay. So the Red Sox bring on a new pitcher, Caleb Ford. And this could be a pretty critical point in this game. They're hoping he's the guy to keep him within striking distance. And now the catcher comes up to him. Jose Trevino. That's towards center. Tapia makes the catch. And that is that. Another look at the long ball for the Yankees. It's now a 2 nothing ball game. Back here at Fenway Park, we head to the bottom of the fifth. And now the first baseman, Tristan Casas. Back Your now to start please. the bottom of the fifth and taking now. over on the mound, Wandy Peralta. Well, he's the guy they hope to turn to out of the pen to lock down wins. So this game has gone to plan, more or less. Let's see if he can wrap it up here. The Red Sox with some bullpen action. Richard Blyer, the veteran southpaw, is getting ready to come on if needed. That pitch started in and ended up on the outside edge, just changing planes and very difficult. Just Goes down looking. Well, big strikeout right there, and maybe a little controversial with the call. I think he got a little bit of favor on the mound, no question about it. It's not exactly what you want to see in a big spot like that, and I'm sure there's some chirping going on from the dugout, making it clear that wasn't his best call behind the plate today. So digging in, Christian Arroyo. His first hit bat was a strikeout. That well, one misses. Ball one. As a pitcher, you know the runner on second is ready to push things with his speed. A base hit is probably going to be a big run, so you really have to execute on the mound. 
2-0 to Cal. Here it comes. Bounce to the right side. Torres over to first. And they're down to their last out. Well, there's a lot riding on that at bat right there. Nice yeah, job of the pitcher to bear the down, center. make the pitch, get the ground ball. ball. Excellent piece of work. Tapia. And now the center fielder, Rymel Tapia, doubled in his first A.B. And that's in for a strike. That was just paint on the first pitch fastball. Oh, and two as he waves at that one. Right. Two outs with a runner at third. And right back to the mound. Throw to first. Ball game. And the Yankees claim the win here behind some great pitching and defense. Kind of a strange win. Only three hits. So they definitely weren't firing on all cylinders there. Great pitching. Really kept them in it and gave them a chance. 2-0 your final here in this one. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew here at MLB The Show, thanks for stopping by. I'm John Chambi. Talk to you soon.